How old were you when you went pro? I was probably, I went pro in 88, so I was 17. Yeah. But it was kind of local pro, like Mickey Thompson, yeah, racing yeah, yeah. Mickey Thompson races. Um, I raced my first Supercross in 89. Yeah. I raced a couple West Coast races. Mm -hmm. And then 90 was my first time I raced the West Coast Series. And then 91, I was Team Honda. Yep. Yeah. So rad. Yeah, I mean, you were so authentic, though. That, like, that word is just, that's you. And, and, and it goes the same with you. That's why I could see there's, like, a common <laughs> friendship there. Or, like, you'd probably be the closest to their world at the time mm -hmm. of freestyle. But in terms of, like, your whole authentic vibe and persona, like, even me growing up, I didn't race Supercross. I'm not a, a world champion, but, you know, everybody loves to go to the track and watch. And I grew up watching at X Games with Step Up and stuff. And you were like the epitome of what it meant to be cool in that world. And then you had like the militia guys. That was it. It was the, your name and them. Everybody else was more of an athlete. You were still winning, but you had this cool <coughs> energy about you, this persona. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I think I think that's really cool. I, I, I mean, uh, I think on the race, on the race, definitely on the, the racing side, mm -hmm. People always like were always loving like w that I wasn't just strictly always lap doing lap times, you know. No, you'd be out in the hills having fun, shoveling right. jumps, like still roots, like yeah. crusty, like all exactly. that stuff. Doing like, different stuff like step up and just trying. I mean, look, the first dirt bike race I ever competed in as a little kid was a Jim Connor. The actual Jim Connor. Was it really? It was a barrel race and then it was like a <laughs> keyhole race because it was at the rodeo in Elsinore. No way. Yeah, it was pretty crazy. So that was like when I was 10 years old, I had a little RM80 and that first time I ever raced a dirt bike competed really was in a Gymkhana and it was hilarious Yeah, because I mean, a Gymkhana, just the same as in a horse or on your, in your car or whatever, uh, you're against the stopwatch. You're not against each other and it's no. just fun as shit, see how right? Fast you can go. Yeah. See how fast you can rip the barrel, see how fast you can go down and get in this keyhole and turn around and and uh, it was it was just a really good time. And and that was four years before I ever competed, like at Paris Motocross Track to race my dirt bike in a race. 